Good afternoon from the CBS 19 Newsroom. I'm Jillian Sheridan. And I'm Justin Early. Thunderstorms in Smith County this afternoon. Storms rolled through the area around 2.30. There are reports of trees down and power outages. We'll have the latest on the impact coming up tonight. Tyler ISD employees are getting raises for the first time in three years. The Tyler ISD Board of Trustees voted today to give across the board pay raises of 4 to 5 percent, depending on the employee. Teachers last got raises in 2010, but other employees haven't seen a pay raise since 2009. How much that will cost the district tonight? Shelby Regional Medical Center is closed as of noon today. That's in center in Shelby County. The rest of the hospital closed earlier this week, but the ER shut down today. We're looking at the reasons why and what patients in the area should do now tonight. The Humane Society of Northeast Texas has received reports of dog napping in East Texas. People are reportedly impersonating animal control officers and Humane Society employees, forcing East Texans to give up their pets. We'll show you what to look for and how to protect your family pets tonight. With temperatures rising again in East Texas, a warning not to leave children in hot cars, not even accidentally. The temperature inside a car rises quickly in the summer heat, and that can be deadly to a child or anyone. Some devices and tricks to help you never accidentally leave your child in a car coming up tonight. Join us for all that, plus weather and sports tonight on KYTX CBS 19 News at 5 and 6. And remember, you can get the latest news anytime online at CBS19.tv.